Spurgeon here with Revzilla TV to talk to you today about the Dionese Decor Socks available at Revzilla.com. Now, the Dionese Decor Socks. Let's just ignore the fact for a second that I'm wearing a sock puppet on my hand. Mom, I'm 32 years old and I'm getting paid to play with puppets. That's pretty damn cool. Now, what we're talking about with the Dionese Decor Socks is going to be a part of the decor lineup from Dionese. They're gonna use body mapping to find the best way to give you added comfort, added breathability, and added grip to make sure that your ride is going to be the most comfortable out there on your motorcycle. What you're looking at is three different types of socks. You're gonna have the low footy sock, you're gonna have a mid-height sock, and then at the very end you are going to have a tall sock, which was actually the same sock that makes a great hand puppet for all you kids out there that are looking for a $25 pair of socks to make sock puppets with. Now, really what we're looking at here, sizing is gonna be three different sizes, small, medium, and large. The small is going to range from a 38 up to a 41. The medium is going to range from a 41 to a 43. And then a size large is going to go from a 44 all the way up. Again, all of those three sizes are available in the footy, the mid, as well as the high. With Dionese, this is a street premium brand. We know them, we love them, we ride with them. With their socks, this is gonna come in around that $25 price point, depending on which one you go with, and there is going to be a lot of technology based in here. So let's pull up a footy sock, and we'll break down exactly what we're looking at. Now, the footy sock that you're going to see is gonna be just an ankle-high sock, but what you're really getting is a bunch of technology built into a very basic piece of gear that we normally don't really think about. 85% poly nylon blend with 15% elastane. Really nice, tight, snug grip. What you're gonna see with the footy sock, starting with the base, you're gonna have reinforcements at the toe as well as the heel. That's the section that's done in gray. This is gonna give you a little bit of extra padding. You're then gonna have grip sections, which are gonna be right at the ball of your foot and again at the heel. And again, this is just gonna help to dig in so your foot isn't slipping around inside of your boot. And then the final point you're gonna notice here on the footy is there is a level of compression. This is gonna snug it down around the middle of your foot. And what compression does is it helps so you don't have muscle fatigue. Really simple piece, but it does add to the longevity of you being able to ride comfortably. Now, rounding out the footy sock, you're gonna see a little bit of a waffle print at the top, and this is gonna to help to wick sweat away. Again, the compression band around the bottom, and then that waffle print on top helps to pull the sweat off of your foot. Now, moving on to the mid sock. What you're gonna notice with the mid sock is that it's gonna give you all the same features as the footy. You're gonna have the extra padding at the toe, at the heel, you're gonna have the grip. The one thing you're gonna lose is while you see the waffle printing up top to help pull that sweat away, if you take a peek at the bottom on these, there's not gonna be any compression on the mid or the high sock. That compression strip is only gonna be along the bottom of the footy sock. Now, as you work your way up the heel on the mid, you are gonna have reinforcements on both the lateral and the medial side. Extra little bit of padding here to give you comfort. Working up the back, you're gonna see again that waffle print coming into play. This is gonna to help to regulate temperature. It's gonna pull sweat away. It's gonna wick sweat away from your high temporal zones, and it's just gonna give you more comfort. The other thing to note is there's a really nice pull done up at the very top of this to help to get the sock on, help to get the sock off, and you are gonna have those elasticated panels working its way up. One of the things that I really like about this, again, keep in mind that compression, as it really compresses against your muscles, helps to reduce muscle fatigue. Now, last but not least, we are gonna have the high sock, and this is gonna give you all of the same features that we've seen with the mid, as we've seen with the footy, but this is gonna give you a much taller version, and I have actually, I've stuffed it inside our little mannequin foot here, but you can see how high up this goes. This is pretty much like a knee sock from the 80s. Again, really nice stretched zone through the back. You are gonna have that temporal zone at the back of the foot on this, and then you're also gonna see right around the shin area, that temporal zone with that waffle pattern working its way up the front, really working to pull the sweat away while adding compression in. And again, that nice pull up at the top to make sure you can get the sock on and off with ease. So what you're looking at with the Dionese socks is going to be an upgrade over standard socks. Something you don't normally think about. A lot of times we go out there, we ride all day with our regular Hanes gold toe socks on there. But this is a small upgrade that you can make to your collection and it really is gonna be a huge comfort upgrade 
for you based on muscle fatigue, extra comfort, as well as sweat wicking properties. Now there are a lot of folks out there that are rocking Dionysa gear. If you wanna hear more about what they have to say, click the info button, read what other riders are digging about the Dionysa gear they're rocking on their rides. If you have more questions for us, never hesitate. Get us on the phone, give us a call, 877-792-9455, or simply type us out an email, cs at ribzilla.com. Thank you for joining us for this look at the Dionysia Decor Socks. I'm Spurge. Enjoy the ride.